You won't believe how fresh this key lime tartar sauce is. If you've had a fresher tartar sauce, hit me up with a comment. Let me know. Welcome to the Sauce and Gravy channel. This is Johnny Mac, and we're going to dive into a fresh tartar sauce. Yes, a key lime tartar sauce. Buckle up. Let's go. Start off with a little prep work. Grab some dill. Give it a nice chop. I'm using about roughly one tablespoon of chopped dill. Grab a mixing bowl, it's time to throw everything together. This is a fairly simple recipe. We're going to use 1 fourth of a cup of sour cream, that's about 60 grams. Grab a little mayo, it's time to add it to this tartar sauce recipe. 3 tablespoons, that's about 35 grams. And this is a savory sauce, we're going to put in a little dill relish, 1 third of a cup, or about 60 grams. Get a little bit of that dill relish juice, pour it on in about 1 tablespoon or 15 milliliters. Squeeze half of a key lime, or you can use a lime if you like. That's about one tablespoon or 15 milliliters. Now it's time to grab that dill that we chopped up at the beginning of the recipe and pour it on in. That's about one tablespoon. Season this sauce for fish with a little bit of pepper and salt. Put in one eighth of a teaspoon of black pepper. I'm putting in one eighth of a teaspoon of salt also, but you can adjust the salt to your taste. Grab a spatula, give it a mix, and there you go. You have an easy, savory sauce for fish. Well, thanks for watching the Sauce and Gravy channel. I hope that you enjoyed this key lime tartar sauce for fish. Don't forget to hit that like button, share this recipe with your friends, smash that subscribe button, and to remember as always, to live love and make gravy.